Zuma Radio, AM 740, downtown Toronto, FM 96.7. A little bit of soul, the music explosion. The Happy Gang is here. Myself, Neil Headley, good morning. Jane Brown here. And yes, Lily Frost hanging out with us all morning. Thanks for doing this. Hi. You're a very Hi. busy person. <laughs> um, we're going to talk uh, to more, uh, some more with Lily uh, between now and 10 o'clock. She's sticking around all the way till 10. If you are looking for a Halloween event... Yes. Where you actually, that actually happens on Halloween. Because our boo bash mm-hmm. happens just down the hall here in Zoomer Hall on mm. October the 27th. Mm. Uh, you know, the Friday you before both. Halloween. Right? You can do yeah. both parties. Because if you want to actually do something on Halloween, yeah. so have this we is got like, a gig for you. It's already a dress up event normally, right. but then extra dress up for Halloween, of course. I like that. So, and we have burlesque, boylesque, a DJ, um, dance classes, um, Live music, cocktail specials, dance contest, prizes. Jane, was boylesque a term that you had even heard until <laughs> until Big wow. City? So until I mean, last week, it's all fair play, right, and yeah. gender equality. Exactly. Yeah. I didn't even know. I didn't even know it was a thing. Something I didn't even for know the ladies. For the ladies, <laughs> it's like the new version of Chippendale, maybe. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Um, so give me the whens and the wheres. I mean, it's called Big City Social. Where's it happening? It's at Lula Lounge, Lounge yeah. and it starts at seven. On October 31st, that's the Tuesday, you can get tickets at lilyfrost.com through Eventbrite, and the early bird ticket special is $15 right now. That's fun. Have that's you, a whole uh, pile of entertainment. Did you decide in your costume yet? <laughs> um, it's still being formulated, but we have lots of special things being curated musically and visually, so yeah, it's going to be good. It's a treat. Yeah, it is a, it, it is a, uh, a feast for all senses, if you will. Uh, once That's you right. Get to, right? Uh, once you go to one of the big cities. So and plus it's mostly, it's very dance heavy. Like everyone's, the dance floor is packed. Be prepared is what you're saying. If you don't want to dance, you don't have to. But if you don't know where to go to dance, this is definitely a good place for it. Oh, so and you learn the moves. So then once you have them, then you can use them. Is your now uh, talk to me about your small person uh, that uh, that's in your life? Is your small person going out for Halloween and dressed as anything? Oh, my little kids. Yeah. Uh yes, my daughter's going to be a cat. A cat. Yes, with a okay. long tail. Nice, fun. Yes, but they're going to have to go out with their dad. Yeah. This time, but they're yeah. okay with that. Good. They fun. actually suggested it to me. So oh, that really? was so sweet. Yeah, they're that very <laughs> mature and yeah. proactive. Well, and you're involved in the costume and all of that, yeah. right? You'll see the pictures. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's cute. And you got to give dad some time, too, for those special occasions. Exactly. Yeah. See, I never I never dug the whole thing about my about going out not by myself when I was a kid. You know, because I had worked out this whole, I was going to be the, like the creature from the swamp kind of thing, you know, and I had this walk down that made me look scary and all that. And I had been practicing since like May for wow. my creature from the swamp <laughs> costume when I was a kid. And I get to the door and it's Halloween and I'm ready and I'm re- they're going to give me all their candy because my, I'm just so convincing. As the, And yeah. I knock on the door and I'm like, ah, I'm the creature from the swamp and... and <laughs> And that's my mom over there. It just, it's, it's, right. It just kind of doesn't work. Yeah. My mom meant well, but. Yeah, but even the How creature old from, you from when the you swamp did has a mom. <laughs> yeah. probably a movie somewhere in there, right? <laughs> I was the mom of the creature from the swamp. <laughs> I don't know. How old were you? I was like six or seven. Well, uh-huh. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah, you need an adult. Well, yeah. <laughs> Are you yeah. kidding? I need Night. adult supervision now. I mean, who's kidding? <laughs> exactly. Let's be honest with he has each a, other. Here. Someone standing right next to him. Holy smokes. Uh, <laughs> Lily Frost hanging out here with the Happy Gang. We are going to uh, stick around with her for a little bit more. I want to play you another track off of her EP. Um, and this is the radio edit of the title track from this. Try to uh, guess the edited word. Right? There's, yeah. Yeah. It starts with a, a B. Yeah. And it, it doesn't have to do with bingo. <laughs> Not at all. It's called rebound and then the B word. Yeah. Lily Frost here at Zuma Radio. <laughs>
Zuma Radio, AM 740, downtown Toronto, FM 96.7. Lily Frost there and Rebound. It's uh, the happy gang. Lily has joined the gang this morning. Thanks for sticking around and doing this today. I'm all here for you. Uh, here of course, you. Uh, October the 15th is the start of Crooners and Songbirds, Lily's four-episode series here on Zuma Radio. Uh, October 15th, 6 p.m., where she's going to play all kinds of great music and perform a bunch of it as well. Um, October the 31st, Big City Social, the Halloween edition, uh, and, and of course, Lily's new record as well that features that song, Rebound. Where do we get a hold of that? Because there's, what, how many songs on the EP? You can get it live yeah. at the Lula Lounge on October 31st, or you can download it off Spotify or iTunes. Cool. Four oh, right. songs. Four songs. Four of them. Yes. Okay. See, yeah. she saves the radio edit of the Rebound song just for us. That's right. You get both you on get the that EP. Uncensored version. <laughs> <laughs> the naughty it's, version. Well, seventeen <laughs> after nine right now. Uh, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a soggy one, sadly today. Well, at least a thirty percent chance of sog. Uh, Twenty six degrees is where we're going. We get some sunshine tomorrow and twenty nineteen on Friday. No doubt you've heard the expression "no news is good news." Well, that's not true of Zoomer news. Much of our news.